Hi guys, welcome to Hidden Blemishes. Um, today I'm going to be telling you and teaching you and ho hopefully giving you helpful tips on how to lose weight. Um, I used to be about 233 pounds, so I've been overweight and I know what it's like and I know how trapped you feel and I know I know the feeling and I know that losing weight is totally worth it. That hard work you have to put in, completely worth it. You just have to start. You can't you can't put it off anymore. The more you put it off, the more you're going to wish you had started before. Um, the first thing I would suggest for someone starting to lose weight would be figure out how many calories you need. If you're a heavier person, you need to eat more, but you will still lose. Like A lot of people are afraid of actually eating, but your body needs fuel, and if you don't if you don't put body in your, if you don't put food in your body, you're not gonna, you'll lose weight, but it's not, it's temporary. And my whole thing when I lost weight is, okay, if I'm gonna put in the effort to lose weight, it has to be off permanently. Like, I'm not just gonna do a diet, I'm not gonna starve myself. I want it to be gone. I wanna put in hard work, and I just wanna be done. And I promise if you follow this plan, you're not gonna gain it back right away as if you were starving yourself. Um, Basically what I did, and I would have eaten more if I was more educated, was I ate 1,200 calories a day and I worked my ass off in the gym every single day. And that's really what I did for 10 months and I lost 85 pounds. I mean, I did this thing called a fruit flush a few times a month and I'll post a link below. But other than that, really, it just requires more motiv motivation. It requires patience. Like... I can't tell you how many times I fluctuated on the scale and I got so discouraged like I wanted to give up so badly when I saw a five pound gain a ten pound gain but technically you really can't gain that much unless you're eating bad so it's all water weight um, um there's so much I can say about it I really I really don't want to make this video that long um, I'm just gonna probably make a series of these and I'll start with three tips right now so my first tip is get support. Um, I used a site, I'm sure you've heard of it, called Xanga. Um, you can use Tumblr. There's a huge fit, fit blur community where girls are losing weight and some are healthy, some are not healthy. And I suggest if you're trying to lose weight in a healthy way and keep it off, that you look for the healthy girls and make friends and be open and post before and after pictures and just write down everything you eat on your Tumblr or your blog or your support on paper, anything. Find support and that really helped me. Um, second tip is, hmm, I'm trying to think of the three best tips I have. Um, find an exercise you like. Um, don't work out if you don't like it. I mean, honestly, I'm not going to lie and say I had fun in the gym every time. But I found ways to improve my cardio and love what I did. And you just need to figure out what you like. I suggest classes like um, Zumba, Bikram Yoga, like anything. Just do something um, that you like. And it won't seem like a chore to work out every day. Personally, I put up with cardio because I wanted to lose weight. But in the beginning especially, you want to do something you like. Um, and I guess slash get a gym buddy. I never had one, but if you're the type of person who can't work out on their own, then I suggest finding a friend. Um, or meeting people at the gym. I mean, you know. My third tip, um, eat breakfast. That's a big one. Eat before you work out, eat after you work out, but make sure you eat a good breakfast because you're gonna stay full the full the whole day. And it's really important that you're not overeating. And I guess I'm just going to add this tip in. Eat five or six times a day, small meals. Eat a bigger breakfast, but then space it out so you're eating every few hours and you're eating tiny meals because you're not going to get hungry that way. And if you are, maybe you need more calories. Listen to your body. Oh my God. There's so much to say and I have so much information that I'm willing to share. But I don't want to um, make this video, these videos too long. So I will post three more tips later. Bye.